So hopefully you guys, this is Mark from the Ashini, as you should know. <laughs> so hopefully you guys would have set up your PayPal account and your basic eBay account with your PayPal account linked, right? So I have here one of my accounts that's already linked with the PayPal. It's not a virtual account like the one I used in the previous video, but I'm just going to go through what you need to do to set up your eBay store. So you go to my eBay. So you should have had it your PayPal account set up, your PayPal account linked and everything already. So now <clears throat> we want to actually open this store. The reason why we want this store is the store has less, a lower, always $20 a month. You get a number of free insertion fees and lower final, final ending fees. So eBay fees that is. So when you sell an item for $100, the percentage is lower than if you didn't have a store. And if you want to compete with some of the big guys out there, we want to save as much money as possible on every sale. All right? So again, you go to account, you go to subscription, eBay stores, this is what you want to subscribe to. You want to subscribe to the basic account. Remember, you guys are now starting up. The basic account is, is $19.95 a month. If you want to pay the yearly fee, you could pay it and you could always upgrade in the future. But my suggestion would be to choose the $19.95. You see, you get a 200 listings with no, no, month, no um, listing fees. You choose the name of your store and then hit continue and they'll take you to the next page where you'll put in any necessary credit card and so on okay now the name of your store a lot of people make a big deal about the name of the store it isn't it's not a big deal I mean I use my name I use um, John's variety store because you have to remember the majority of people who come to eBay to shop on eBay come to, to knowing that they're buying from other individuals right if you if they want to shop from Target or Walmart or Kmart or whatever they will go to those websites. You'll go to Amazon. When they're coming to eBay, they know they're buying from the little guys like us. So the name isn't a big deal. I have guys who are selling fifty thousand dollars a month with store names that have no real purpose, have no real significance. They're not gonna come to eBay and search for Mark's variety store. They're gonna come to eBay, search for what they wanna buy, and it's our our responsibility to list well on eBay search where our items will show up and they'll purchase from us okay so hopefully you guys did all the previous steps you come here choose the basic store 1995 click through choose the store name and get it subscribed I'm subscribed already so I'm not going to waste time and click it but it's a very basic process alright so hopefully you get a step, step done and go on to the next video in the blog post alright have a great day and I'm excited about getting you set up and having you making money.